Are you kidding me? <laughs> Santa, this one's all you, big girl, just for you. It's all right. <laughs> so you're going to have to get on that head. <laughs> Look at that. The freaking... What? What? Holy shit, all right, Santa. So big. you're going to get on that head. Meg, you're going to help him out and I'll film, all right? Okay. You want to get that head first. She's just moving along right now. Has no idea oh, you're here. She knows you're there. I'll get on that head now. I'll get on it now. Get your foot on the head. There you go. There you go, Meg. Get on that back half. Hold it down. There you go. <laughs> Woo! You're kidding me. You're freaking kidding me. Good job, Tanner. Hold her down. There you go. Put your body weight on her butt. Okay. I got it. Grab behind the head there. <laughs> now put your body weight on there so she can't coil up. Okay. There you go. Push that down, Meg. My phone's sitting on the wall there. Yeah. I'll get okay. that for you. Oh, <laughs> not even. 10 seconds ago, I was just telling Tanner about a 15 footer crossing this road, looked over and saw this log next to the wall. Next to the wall. What? Next to the wall. What? Wow. <laughs> I knew it would happen one day. Dan, I told you good luck. Good luck would happen. We got a cop wow. coming up to you. What? We got a This big girl ended up being 15 feet, three inches in length, and a whopping 126 and a half pounds. We performed an acropsy in a lab where we found she had 70 developing egg follicles. We also found deer hooves in her lower intestine. This native deer was the snake source of energy to pump out 70 more baby pythons. This necropsy is a sobering reminder to why it's so vital to remove reproductive females like this from the ecosystem.